Hello there man, welcome back with another CS 1.6 tutorial. I apologize for not uploading over two freaking weeks because there is nothing much I can upload about this game. Well, until some uh, good servers come up, actually, for real though. But yeah, I just wanna show you how you can like add effects to your like to your any type of weapon model by using these three things. First of all is milk shape, which will do most of the things. Second, you need like an actual like folder with couple effects, which I'll description. But for the tutorial, I'm, I'm willing to use only one effect, which is like the chrome effect. So I'm gonna just leave everything on my Discord server, and you'll find it on the links category. So yeah, and then lastly is you'll need a model. Yeah, for the tutorial, I've chosen up the classic golden AK-47 on zombie play and not the one of CSO's version. So yeah, as you can see in this AK, it does not have like anything or any type of effect. So yep. Now, you're going to start to make a folder and with the effect which I'll drop in here, like in my Discord server. So yeah. Now, what you're going to do is make a copy of the model so for yourself you can see the before and after, like after you've done like adding the effect. So yeah, this is the before and this is going to be the future like model, like the weapons, right? So now we're going to open up Milkshape. Also, by the way, the registration code about Milkshape, I'll leave everything on my disk. Right, so first, since we've added like the AK model in here, inside this folder, for example, I just call it the compiling, compiling models, and yeah, with the effect. Now I'm just going to go on tools, like before, I also go in on here and then use this decompiler, but I do not use none of these because this would fuck up your weapons, like actually, like your weapons, like view model. So what I, what I recommend you to use is this one. Gratisos, I don't know whatever is named, Half-Life MDL decompiler version 1.2, so yeah, I just do this. And now it will ask you for the model file, so you're just going to click on here and you're just going to go to your, like, just find where your, like, uh, folder is located, like, and you're going to work on the weapon, so I'll just double click on here and click OK after, then it will say in the end, done. So now... As you can see in this folder, we have a couple of things in here. And yeah, we have this QC file in here, which you're like going to right click and open. You can choose with whatever app you want to open it. But for this case, I'm going to use Notepad++ because I know Notepad++ is a lifesaver for me when it comes to scripting or doing whatever related to 1.6. But you can use you the basic notepad as well if you don't mind that's that's just like a preference All right so uh now we're going to import the smd now you're going to go file import half-life smd now in here you need to like kind of be careful you must search up for like um a case like model in here like the weapon part because in here there are like parts you're not going to choose like the animations hand or anything what we're here for is a weapon. So I think this is the A case, like the weapon, because for other models, it's going to be completely different. So yeah, I think it's this, so I'm going with this. And after it, it will say like SMD import, and you're going to like make sure these three are checked, and you click OK in here. And as you can see, this is the whole weapon in here. Thank goodness, because for some other weapons, Every single part is like split up. Like, I have no idea why I even do that. All right, so after you're done importing the parts of your weapons, which you're going like to edit for your model, you're going to go on materials in here. And as you can see, we have lots of like BMPs in here listed, which we're going to replace them with the chrome effect, for example. But you can do it with any other thing as you prefer. But yeah. Now, to replace the BMPs with the chrome effect, all we have to do is just, as you can see in here, QS AK1 BMP, click on this, and just double click on the chrome effect, and it's going to look like this, like the material part, but don't worry, this is the good part in here. So yeah, 
as well you can go on the other parts in here right as you can see in, in the materials in here i have changed every single like material part in here so now we must export the smd now we're going to go in here file export half-life smd and you can name this to whatever you want but for example i'm just going to name it ak47 uh underscore chrome something like this but you can name it whatever you want as i said you click save on here it's going to ask for reference coins and the vertex but just save it as reference right we're done with this part but uh now we're going to go to the file and edit the qc file of the weapon like each model when you decompile it will have like a qc file so yeah double click on your qc file so yeah you're going to add like like the dollar sign body then you add this and studio for this part again then just type your weapons name in here which we did like uh exporting the smd but for some other weapons like with the other parts just do it when you export one part do not like do it like body studio like it's the same steps but for example you can save like this like one two like i don't know like, because there are going to be like lots of parts because this this sheet is completely complicated for me it might be for you as well all right when you're done adding the body and the studio part in here click save and you can get off um notepad now you go on tools go on half-life and now from here we can compile the model so yeah and when you click compile it's going to ask about like the qc file in here you just double click on it and as you can see it's completely done not a single error but for some models it might have errors so yeah it kind of sucks i know that but yeah okay we're done with the milkshake so now this is the before like ak golden modeling i'm just going to like do it like this now this is the the ak model which we did edit all right so when you're done the model is going to look like this but do not panic it's very fixable so now as you can see we're going to the textures you see here view glove but we are not here for the glove down here it should be added like the effect like the bmp uh, picture that you have named for your effect for example i just name it like hashtag chrome effect because why not i just more easier for me to work with so now here it is um, the effect which we, we added is ported to our weapon and we're going to select up i mean check up adaptive because yeah that's how it works and as you can see i go in editor and here you go the before and after effects of of the weapon as you can see on my left side this is the golden ak which we did not touch which is basically here and this is the ak which we modified by adding chrome effect for example you can do other effects in here as well but yeah this is about it man every single thing like milkshake app its registration code the effects which i'm going to add as well everything will be on my discord server so see you in another video man